That's about bounds of the family. Everything in Mineko is pretty consistent, especially like ring, ring scene with George and stuff. That sounds like episode one, Butler. Are you sure about that, George? It's time. The parafour for give her a clue. Do not ignore heart. What happened during these six years? The sentence that is hunting me since episode three. Okay, my theory might just fall apart. Hello and welcome, Pocket Watch here, and it's about time for another episode of Umineko Chiru. So yeah, we're going to the episode where probably we're going to discover uh, to who, uh, like, Shannon declares her love. If, yeah, I don't know if she declares actually the love, but I guess she's not. She just like will feel it. Uh, because the new element is probably love. And I assume that we are going to see Butler. Also, in the previous episode, I made terrible mistake. If you never thought that I'm terrible at math, then the previous episode is perfect uh, example of that. So yeah, uh, no Butler uh, definitely exists in seventy six. Yeah, don't ask me. <laughs> Also about Beato appearance, I f gave uh, like a bit like a thought about this, like why Beatrice looks differently now than the next one. So my first initial theory was that she became like dark Beatrice basically later on, but it might not be the case. It might be just because we know how Quadorian Beatrice looked like from the backstory. Um... Uh, uh, and we saw actually how she looked like, so I think like... The change in Beato from like this white dress Beato into like the darker dress Beato uh, changed after Shannon or Yasu, I guess, Beato, however we will call them, uh, discovered who's uh, her mother, basically, and then she was like that's my mother and she will be like i want to like be like her and like she will like imitate her or something you know so she might just change appearance because of that because she like uh, when she find out the truth about like you know uh how her mother looked like because at this point when the beatrice was created by yasu she had no idea who was her parents so yeah also on Discord, like some stuff happened recently, and also I made like fury that Beato might know actually who's uh, her father, like Kinzo, and that's why she's like reprimanding Butler for like escaping from the family. So I assume that Beato, like after like initial shock, maybe she accepted Kinzo as father probably and that's why she's like scolding basically Butler in episode 4 in the um, dialogue on like uh, Beato on the rooftop and Butler being on like ground and stuff you know the way the they were like talking about sin it's just like short story long from like discord so if you want to check more stuff then yeah discord is like in the description you can check it out so yeah anyway let's just go to the episode because it's been too long I mean, like, again, a few days since I, like, last time read. Like I said, like, this month is, like, horrible. And there might be, like, delays and stuff in the episode. Also, something, like, is wrong with my eye recently as well. So, I may, like, sometimes, like, you know, just, like, massage my eye or whatever. So, don't worry. Okay. お体、本当に大事にな Oh, there it is. Okay. No, it's the one that's like striked by the TS or or die. Oh no. Hope is always bad. <laughs> Maria, who Rosa led by the hand, was still too young for the kindergarten. Oh right, it's six years ago. 
Right? It's six years ago, so it's like 1980. Also, yeah, I was wrong about the batteries being created at between 81 and uh, 84. Yeah, that was my mistake by wrongly calculating the butler age and stuff. Don't ask me. <laughs> However, she seems to notice that her cousins, whom she really ever saw, were playing all around her, and she was very excited. Butler and George had the energy of the middle school, or nearly middle school kids. Those two, along with Jessica, who had met up with them on Nijima, were making a lot of noise on the deck. Also, Angel is still not born, right? Yeah, because Maria is like three years older than Enja, if I'm correct, at this point of the story. Like in the 86, she's like three years older, yeah. Oh shit! I just realized this is the time- wait, this is the time when Asuma's life. Oh shit, okay! I just realized that! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god, this, this is like totally took me off by surprise. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. Rudolf lent an arm to his wife Asumu. Show her! Come on! Also, that means that Natsuki is not Asumu. I mean, that, uh, <laughs> that's obvious at this point, but there was like time uh, back in like past theories that maybe like butter is son of like Natsuki or something. The whole family had gathered for the conference. At this point in time, the Rudolf wife was still Asumu and Enja hadn't been born. Golden Cannon hadn't yet been uh, uh, employed by the Shirmiya family, yeah. Uh, and the witch epitaph which would toy family fate hadn't appeared yet, yep. That's what I realized that uh, family epitaph appeared in uh, 84. So we'll see if that's the case or not. They probably couldn't even imagine the bizarre crime uh, that awaited them sev several years in the future. Several? Few. <laughs> Okay. Is Kinzo alive? Yeah, he is. Oh, shit. Okay. We're going to see actually living Kinzo. What if he's like nothing like uh, what we saw him so far? Maybe he's like totally different. In like reality, because all, all we saw before was like uh, imaginary Kinzo that's like everyone saw him. I guess. Oh shit. Oh, come on. That's why he's making her work so hard again. Just what good does she find in such a fussy, alkaline inducing life? I wanted to know. Yeah, Sean wanted to go back to the reality instead of which uh, paradise. Shannon, what is that you found? And what did you mean when you said I already knew what I was missing? Shannon, is this something I must learn by learning about you? <laughs> It's about the bonds! It's about the bonds of the family! And the love! And inheritance. inheritance. We're going to learn all the things that Butler forgot. Also, on the Discord, I made some theories about uh, what would happen if Butler never like come back and like six years later. 
So yeah, like short story long. Uh, for now, I think probably uh, whatever butter would come back or not, then uh, massacre would happen anyway. That's my short sh short take without like going into like details. <laughs>何しろ普段のロッケン島には何もねえんだから。すげえ親しきに住んでたり、プライベートビーチがあったり、ガキの頃は羨ましいと思ってたけど、ジェシカの身になって考えるとはさぞや窮屈だったと思う。いやです。だ
Though they're both on the sword, the relationship is master as master and servant. They somehow managed to strike up a friendship. Then the family conference, Jessica hand introduced Shannon to George and Butler. All of the adults had their hands full of the, their complicated discussions in the mansion. During that time, Shannon was uh, able to put aside her lord as the servant, role as the servant, for a little bit, and act her age with Jessica, George and Butler. Okay. I had no idea that Sean had constructed this new world so quickly. As a butterfly hiding in the shadows, I observed these new worlds of Shannon's. And you are jealous, huh? Eh? You are all alone, just like Sean and Jessica. Beach episodes! It's the same beach as in episode 3. さい。だな。この時ばかりはシャノンちゃんも年相応の笑顔を見せてくれたぜ。ちょっと、はしゃぎすぎてたかもです。ああ。恥ずかしい。今でこそバトラも立派な身長だけど、当時は私やシャノン
夏服の肩からちらりと見える紐に青い春の稲妻を感じたもんだぜ Okay, yeah, that's that sounds like episode one butler. Jojo, no, Aniki, to Ishani, Shannon, Chan, no, Munewa, Ix, Kraika, Yoni, Kosoposo, the Hashi, Atano, Gana, Skazize. Wait, she already was big six years ago? Okay. I felt like she was like pretty much flat because of like this backstory that we had.、Uh, when she asked, like, what's ideal for Button, he was like blonde with like big booba. And now he's like, hey, she was pretty big. I guess he was like 10 years old or something, so every size was big for him. She saw, like, I don't know, like A cup, and that was huge for him. I don't know. I'm not dissing any other、uh, cups, by the way. So, so I'm just telling, like, what he thinks. <laughs> 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 Are you sure about that, George? Bokwa, Danjo no Sejo no Chigani Tite, Jinse no Senpai to stay, Kogio Stakiokua. Sure. Yeah, sure. Itoko do Steno, Yoruno, Waidanwa, Mushiro, Kenzen, the Hatsiko no Akashi de Ate, Sono. Okay, okay, George. Okay. Mina de Itokobea de Shinya Ninaruma de So you Hanasu Stetakin. Okay. Also, this is new for George. This is actually new personality trait for George. I didn't expect him to talk like that with,、uh, about this stuff with Butler. <laughs> I mean, he also was a kid, right? Like, he was like.、Uh, how old was he? Wait. He's like 23?、Uh, so, 5? Wait, he's like five years older than Butler. He's like 15. He's talking with 10 years old about tits. What the fuck, George? Tonari no Kras no Daredari got kissed or star a s h e e toka. Also, yeah, like. We assuming that Shannon. Have a fake age、uh, stated basically. She's not 16 in the 86, but like either 20 or 19, something like that. We theorized that like many times before. So, yeah, it's not like she's like he's like trying to get like 10 year old. Yeah, she's older than that. Because. Okay, I'm not going into this again. Oh my god, we had a discussion about this on Discord like some time ago. About George like being pretty sus because like being like, I don't know, 15 or something and trying to look like basically kid. So yeah, that's definitely weird and like, what the fuck, George? But if she's like faking age, then, then they are like on pretty much more similar level. But yeah, it's. It's still like. Heat topic in community, I would say. When this is going like about that. Summer camp with a sticky than a toe, what did I put to two to the get at that toka? Dare that it was even Nikki Gari so did toka nan toka. Naka has got to take the shit. Okay. What did you like back in the back in the day, Jessica? Did you have a boyfriend? I don't know. 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 Or maybe Jessica had a girlfriend. I mean, she likes Canon, and if Canon is created from Shannon, then Canon, that in essence, is a girl, right? So, yeah. I just want to be together with you. とてもシンプルでピュアでそれでいて高潔な最初の恋素敵だわ年頃の少年少女たちが愛の世界を思い浮かべながら語り合うそそんなこともあありましたでしょうか Why are you not sure? <笑><笑>何をとぼけてるんだか、huh. 
耳まで真っ赤になりながらもシャノンちゃんが一番興味津々って感じだったじゃねえかよ<笑> OK 興味津々なんてことはありませんでしたわ私はそのみ皆さんよくいろいろなことをご存知だなとそのうんシャノンが一番かまととぶっててそのくせ興味津々だ、okay. 一番むっつりスケベだった、okay. <笑><笑>そ,そんなことありませんそんなことありませんバトルはそんなこといですバトルはそんなことありませんそうそんなこいつもこんな感じ昼は子供らしくはしゃぎ合い夜は枕を寄せて秘密の話に花を咲かせたそれら全部をひっくるめてどれも懐かしいねエッチな話をひそひそして親の汗音が近づいてきたらガバッと布団に潜って寝たふりしたりとかあったな<笑>あったあった修学旅行かっつーのあの全員同時にガバッと隠れる感じ Hold on a second, this is a set about school field trips. Oh no. Like some school trips. Okay, never mind, never mind, never mind. I was like, what the fuck for a second. Also, Sean was like sleeping with them. That's, that's not how like, Slavon behaves. I don't think like Natsuki would allow that. I wonder, like, it's amazing, like, how Natsuki didn't, like, figure, like, this thing out, if you think about this, like, it's like, it's like evening or night, right, and she, and what, like, Natsuki never once, like, tried to find Shannon, like, hey, Shannon, you have job, where the hell are you? And she couldn't find her, and she's, like, with cousins, talking about weird stuff. <laughs> How? Not so he, come on. So you Hanashi Dake Janakata, Hokani Mo Yoro Atta. Book Tachima Masani, Seishun O Oka Shiat Okay. Korewa Nanda to you no ka. Shannon? Is that fun thing of the human world? Is this incomprehensible messing around the thing that you found? I mean, all you do is just drinking tea in your golden garden. Yeah, it sounds boring. Hi, Anatania. Sounds fun to me. Well, you cannot grant me a wish of like having a bunch of friends and having fun with them because only you and me are the you know, like golden, uh, uh, golden paradise. It is, but it depends. I'm pretty much introvert, and yeah, interacting with people is not that fun for me. I mean, like, if they're like bunch of like new people, on like, or like if like I need to like get like personal to some if so, to someone, it's not fun at all. <laughs> but, but yeah, if you are like with a bunch of friends and not just like with people that you want to like mess around, then yeah, it is fun. あなたの世界も楽しいものだと思います。それでも私はこちらを選びます。わからぬ、わからぬ。Patrice held her head as though she was having a headache, but no matter how much she grimaced, she couldn't think of an answer. ポシエよ、そなたは。Come on, Zeppar. Okay. It's time. It's time. Zeppar, Furfur, give her a clue. 
<laughs> Give her the famous, famous clue. Come on, you have to do this. Oh, maybe, she, maybe they will not do this. Okay, Sean just will say love, okay. I wanted Zeppar and Purfu to, to tell her that Hey, we are going to give you a clue Without love it can't be seen Take your stuff out from this <laughs> There's the backstory with the battle that we saw in the uh, episode 6 Right? Yeah, episode 6. Uh, let's see if it's something new. Oh, Butter brought like some book for Shannon from the mainland, I guess. Okay. もらってしまっては悪いです。高いものでしょうし。バザーで本の何百円かでまとめ買いしたやつだから。気にするなって。それより早く全部読んで、またいろいろと議論をしよう。はい。私も楽しいです。ミステリーは一人で読むよりも二
for us to spend time alone together. There are no, there many. Is that true? Let me know in the comments. I have, uh, like, like I said, Umineko is basically my first mystery, like, story ever. So, is that true that not that not many mystery novels care about why do it? I wonder. Why do it? Do? Hani no doki desu ka? Ah, suiri shousets de sagru beki. Mitsu no ronten wa who da it, how da it, so shite why da it. Kono zensha futatsu wa atsukau shousets wa kekko oi to omou ga. Ah. I never knew about that. If that's actually the, if that's actually true. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So that's the point. Yeah. 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 Who do it? Who's the culprit? How do it? Who? How did they commit the crime? Why do it? Why did they commit the crime? I'm struggling with the last one the most. I can like, like who do it? I would say, uh, like I have like two suspects. Basically, like, first is, like, Shannon, obviously, because of, like, this, like... Basically, Shannon is bad, but bad will have issues with Butler for, like, living six years ago and having his thing and stuff. So, yeah. Uh, and the second, uh, which is, like, highly possible, is uh, Kyria. It's just theorized based on, like, her uh, backstory and how she would say that she would like do everything for Ludorf and stuff like that. I'm not going to dive deep into this because it will like take another few minutes of my time. I talked about this like when we had like Kiria backstories and like probably in some episodes later as well. So yeah, like basically we have love issues and gold issues. I would say. And that's why we have also Maria dying in two different like styles, I would say. One is like more peaceful and one is more aggressive because both of these people feel differently about about Maria. Uh, yeah. But why do it? This is kind of... It's, it's, it's evading me. It's still evading me. I can like think about like gold issue why do it like they need money okay like all of them and they figured out that, that there's gold and Rudolf need money as well and Kyrie is like hey this thing it belongs to my husband now nobody touch it if you touch it I'm going to murder you and yeah it might like call my chain reaction and stuff just like I said but in Shannon case like why butter disappearing for six years and then like george like giving her ring and stuff it's like triggering like whole thing like what the f like why what's your problem shannon are you just crazy because like butter left you for like six years did you just like went crazy and just murdered everyone out of like spite いや。ほとんどだろうな。しかし、同居推理する作品ってのは決して多くないと思う。そうですね。ふう、ハウ、ワイの the heart, that's what Willard always says. Do not ignore heart. 
心人の心ってのはすごく重要だと思うんだ人間が殺人を決意し、うん、計画し準備し実行に踏み切るにはものすごい大きな心の力が必要なはずなんだ I still don't see reason why In other words, only the heart can kill a person. When an emotional upheaval up grows strong enough to make a person want to kill, the result is a tragedy called murder. But I need another way around. That means that the true way to close in on the crime is by searching for the heart that brings uh, about the tragedy of murder. So we need to understand heart of Beatrice, basically. I don't understand heart of Beatrice. She just sound like crazy. Only the heart can kill. So if a person has been killed, you must search for the heart. That's uh, what he told me. That's what he told me. 犯人がただの殺人狂で面白半分に事件を起こしてるって作品はなんだか少し好きになれない。Okay, and this sentence gives me like basically yeah, like me thinking that battle is just crazy is basically only because I cannot like reason out right now logical reason why. I know, like, you loved Butler and stuff, but come on! Like, what? And, yeah, this sentence is basically just confirmation that that's not the case, because Butler told this to her, and she will not, like, like to give Butler basically the mystery game, whatever, you know, the events of Rokenjima, in a way that he would, like, find, like, not fun. I mean, it's not fun, but you know what I mean. Like opposite of what he likes. So, yeah, Def she's definitely not just the uh, homicidal maniac. There's something. There's something about love. What? Come on. So <laughs> そしてそれを推理させてくれる作品が。What happened during these six years? As he spoke, he looked back at me and smiled. Before today, I used to like novels that focus on exposing the tricks. I've already started to look for novels like the ones he recommended in the future. ココロってやつを。はあ。OK。人は。He's basically Willard. This isn't limited to the mystery genre. All people at all times are driven by their hearts. Figuring out the heart is the essential of interaction between people. No interactions between the hearts. None of us humans can live on our own. And yet, we have no way of peeking into hearts of others. That's why everyone meeting people be, uh, that's why every meeting between people is its own mystery of the heart. Encountering those mysteries, reasoning about them, and understanding them, so that allows people and hearts to connect with one another. The two of us uh, are here, but ourselves, talking together about mysteries. And through that, we're exploring each other's heart and deba uh, debating as mysteries. I want you to feel about me. I want you to feel about me the way I feel about you. We are both exploring, trying to figure out the depths of the other's heart in this mystery of love. Why murdering everyone? Including yourself, if you think about this. Because Shannon dies in Rokenjima as well. Like, what's wrong with you? 
兄貴たちを待たせちゃってるかなそろそろ戻った方がいい時間ですねシャノンちゃんと話してるとあっという間に時間が過ぎちまうな He seems to be speaking the words of my heart. We were thinking the same thing, but the same words came out. So, basically, Butler never told Shannon that he likes her, right? Like, none of them confessed. Because we know from like episode 3, Butler said that Shannon was like his first love. So Butler is aware of his feelings, but he never confessed to her because he disappeared after like this event, I guess, six years ago. And Shannon never, Shannon never had her like uh, opportunity to tell him that she loves him as well. And they just like fall apart. The Butler like forgot all about stuff. I mean, he obviously still remembered that he loved Shannon because he mentioned that in the episode 3, so it's not like he disappeared completely in his mind. Uh, okay, what do you... Butler, what do you remember? What... what you forgot? What did you forget? So far, I see that you remember everything. I'm <laughs> ロッケン島で一番楽しいのはこうしてシャノンちゃんと話すことだからな。OK。When I saw that,、uh, when I saw that his smiling eyes were、uh, looking right at me, I turned around. I couldn't let him see my suddenly red face. 私も外の世界へ出られたならもっともっとたくさんの本を読めるのに。Yep, and she definitely wants to go away from Rock and Jima. We know that. The bookshop in,、uh, on Nijima that I go, go to, and the bookshop、uh, Nijima that I go to, and the bookshop he goes in the city are on completely different scales. The book exchange between the two of us had been completely one sided with him giving me all the books. Shannon chan wa, itsma de s h i o n i o t s u k e r ki nanda. Yeah, because as we know, they can like resign anytime, really. Okay. Is that a thing that he forgot? He said it almost carelessly. Maybe he was a bit embarrassed since he laughed. We claimed blush. We can see blush actually in this screen. Look at that. This is the, these lines. So, s t a r a Konda mo. Jikan mo nani mo kini sezi ni sumu mo na. Okay. So this ne. Zuto. Isha ni irare mas ne. So he forgot about this? But Shannon never resigned as being servant. So that could never happen. It's not like she appeared like at Butler door and he was like, who the hell are you? It never happened. So I still don't see an issue. Even if he forgot about this, it doesn't matter. She never like resigned being a servant. So remembering this have like no. No consequences. Turn the secret dates on this island only happened a few times a year. And even when they did happen, it was only for a short, uncertain period of time. We don't work over the phone or with letters. We can only talk about our mystery when we are standing together like this. Okay. You will come as what? Certain. How can he be certain? The sentence that is haunting me since episode 3. When this thing dropped in episode 3 on the beach episode, I got so fixated on this and pointing this as like the line that makes Butler Shan crazy. Because he never came back. Like, hey, you promised to come back with riding like white horse and you never came back. Like, I, I'm so fixated on this, on this sentence. This is like one of the most, like, 
That's the second sentence that's haunting me most right after the without love uh, it can't be seen. Uh. After saying this, he turned away. He was probably too proud to show me his blushing cheeks. But even without seeing, I knew what his face looked like. To come riding on white horse. Um, who did that again? Uh, isn't that like a fairy tale prince? So what exactly does that? Uh, uh, does that mean he's going to be my prince? Oh my god! Yes, it does mean that. My mind was going blank, so I just couldn't reason out his mystery of love, even though it was all plain and simple. As soon as you make up your mind. Okay. Okay, now. Okay, I think I know now. Okay, uh, before they go anywhere else. I think I know what he bought butter for God. Shannon probably resigned as being a servant someday during these six years and butler actually did not come back and she for and she thought that he like betrayed her basically her, uh, her feelings uh, or he, he just like played with her with her heart i will go with this because of that let's see <laughs> As soon as you make up your mind, my heart skipped a beat. It was so sweet, yet it hurt. Okay. Also, on the other hand, if Shannon will like try, uh, want to be the servant her whole life, that means she will have to say goodbye to her prince. That's another thing. What if Shannon cannot resign? Because what if Genji and Kumasawa like know about Shannon? You know, like we said, like they basically know about Beatrice. Uh, and they basically don't like let her uh, resign from being the servant. That means that like she cannot like fulfill her love basically. There's a lot of like things can go wrong in this. <laughs> はい。その日まで。ずっと待ってるぜ。オッケー。バター definitely forgot about that. If I were a bit more foolish and could uh, courageous, I would have told him that my mind is already made up. And I could have asked him to make me away from this island right now. Okay, and she never did that. And then she regretted it. Okay, I think it's getting like more clear. I still don't know why would you murder whole family for that. But outside of like being crazy because like of like betrayal of, or like feeling of betrayal. Maybe there's something more? I know like it's about like unfulfilled love, I guess. But... Murdering everyone? She's just crazy. Also murdering herself, as I said. If you think about this, because no one survived uh, Rock and Jima outside of Eva, who died anyway later on, like in the hospital, but still. She's the only one who survived. But I can't. I have to think carefully about my future for both of our sakes. My head filled with pointless, senseless thoughts. <laughs> with his back still to me, he scratched his head and laughed. I knew he was doing this out of embarrassment, so I could clearly tell what his expression must have been looked. In the same way, he must have realized what my face looked like when we both uh, were both puzzle solved lovers. So, uh, solvers of love, okay. We theorize about each other's love, solving each other's mysteries. This is so cool. I like the, how they like make this. 
So, basically, I, w I wonder if, like, the games that we see on Rokenjima that battle made, like, the mystery game, or, I mean, the murders, right? If this is, like, not murder murder mystery for Beato, but love mystery for Beato. For Butler not realizing, like, I mean, I guess why do it is basically finding heart of Beato right so yeah it's like mystery of love so but you have to figure it out why shannon's doing that like i mean beato from butter perspective okay. oh wait she wait now Okay, my theory might just fall apart. Oh, I will. Okay, never mind. Okay. And that never happened! Okay, we have the trigger. If one year from now, you still feel certain about coming for, for me on the white horse, and me too. If I still like you a year from now, I would like to de dedicate the rest of my life to you. Butler, you fucked up. One yeah. So Butler basically forgot about this promise. He just fucked up by forgetting this, escaping from Rudolf to his like who who that was like uncles, grandparents. I don't remember who these people were. Uh, and he never came back one year later because he was fixated on like Asumu death and Enjaber uh, like being a uh, Enja birth basically I mean not birth uh, Kiria was like pregnant but yeah basically he like felt so angered and stuff about his family that he forgot about Shannon Ah, Butler, Butler, it's all your fault. It really is your fault, but still... Shannon, why you murder everyone because of that? I guess you blame everyone for, like, taking Butler away from you? Like, like that? Like, you just, like, it's like you are like, hey, it's because of you that Butler forgot about me, so I will take my revenge. But she still like says that she will like forgive Butler in the episode 4, so she still have issues with Butler. I mean, obviously she have issues with Butler. For not remembering. But yeah. And that's the promise he forgot. He responded to my call as well with a quick strong answer. We already know that's not going to happen. Nope. Oh, wow. I just realized. Oh, my God. Battle is so good. Wow, you remember in red how Beato, oh wow, Beato said in red one time, I keep my promises. It was like a dream for Beato, Beato multiple times said that she uh, keep her promises. Wow, she's basically mocking Butler for not keeping his promise. She's blaming Butler for not keeping his promise. 
in this like red truths about herself that I keep my promises. Wow, I just realized that could be a thing. Holy shit, that was in like plain view since like episode 2 when the first red truth happened. Wow. Definitely. Yeah, sure, definitely. <laughs> I see. So this emotion that feels like sweet suffocation is love. It is, uh, it is an emotion I do not know. One I do not possess. To, though my magic can grant any wish. Though my paradise can grant any wish. It is something I cannot have. An incomprehensible emotion that burns like fire. And yet one desires madly to hold it close. All I know is that no matter how great a witch I might become, I cannot create this emotion. It must be given. It must be given by another person. For the first time, I realized that I was not all powerful, and I knew that Shan had discovered in what Shan had discovered in the world of humans. <laughs> Mm hmm Shannon, you win. Love, is it? It may be the most important element, the, and the one that I lack. Shannon, I shall observe from afar the curse of your love. Go forth and teach me more and more about this new emotion. Yeah, it's going to take the bad uh, term. Okay, th this episode was extremely important for the story. That was like extremely important for theory crafting and stuff. Days of trial. Ha, huh, interesting. Days of trial, what that can mean? <laughs> I have some like, okay, I have idea. I will go for save because we're going to end the episode here. Uh, but the days of trial, I think we are going to have the episode that's going to tell us maybe one year after and some time, maybe like span of like two years. Maybe it's like, you know, a uh, year after Butler didn't come back. But Shannon still have like her hope that Butler will come back. So like one or two years or maybe even like more up until 84 when Butler was created, when the epitaph was created. Maybe she was still hoping for Butler. And these are the days of trial for her like keep Butler in her heart, basically. And keeping like believing in him. Hmm. Yeah, like episode 7 is definitely like incredibly important and interesting. I love this so far. So yeah, uh, anyway, uh, uh, thank you for being with me. Thank you for uh, your comments, for your likes on this episode. And yeah, I don't think I have like anything else to say. I need to like, as always, uh, cool down a bit. And maybe like uh, I will do like some um, theories and like give you some uh, my, my ideas or something on Discord as usual. And in the next episode I will probably talk to you about uh, these ideas if I get any. But yeah, got like few things out of this. So thank you everyone for this episode. Let me know in the comments what you think. And leave up a like if you like the episode. Dislike if you like it. You can subscribe if you want to subscribe. Check my Discord, which is in the description. You can also become a member if you want to support me and have these episodes even earlier than everyone else. And yeah, I will see you in the next one. So thank you everyone once again. And for now, Pocket Watch is going out.